Hi, my name is Atsushi Seiken. I'm from uh, the session of uh, New Models for uh, Aging Society. I am the one of the discussion leader there. And uh, one important uh, thing that I have learned from the session is, you know, in order to cope with aging population, it is extremely important for us to promote the employment of older people. If more older people who have the will and the ability are able to continue working beyond the current retirement age, uh, you know, the many of the problems caused by aging population could be solved or at least uh, be softened to some extent. You know, the increase in number of active workers and uh, active consumers in their old age will be a driving force of uh, uh, economic growth, both in demand side and uh, supply side of the macro economy in the aging society. And also, it will reduce the you know, per capita burden of uh, uh, the cost of aging society. I mean, uh, particularly the cost of social security in the aging society. And uh, this is another important aspect. So anyway, we need to establish a lifelong active society in which the will and the ability of all the people can be fully utilized. And I think in order to make it possible, some of our public systems, including our public pension system, should be devised not to you know, discourage all the people to continue working. Also, you know, uh, at the workplace, the retirement age should be uh, raised. So, again, in order to make it possible, uh, we need to revise such employment practices as uh, seniority-based wages that may make, you know, the employment of older people more costly for the employee. Anyway, these uh, uh, public systems and, uh, you know, employment practices are a man-made uh, system so we will be able to you know devise or you know overcome some you know the negative effect from these institutions now uh, i'm from japan and uh, the japan is now the world number one aging society i mean uh, the proportion of older people aged 65 years old and over is now almost uh, one quarter of total population so uh, we definitely need to have a, a lifelong active society then last year the great east uh, japan earthquake that struck on the March of 11, uh, last year, uh, and, uh, you know, that uh, earthquake and the resulting tsunami, you know, uh, made a, a tremendous disaster on an unprecedented uh, scale. So we should not fail to uh, reconstruct the affected area as soon as possible. And we know that the you know uh, the affected area is even you know uh, faster uh, aging than uh, uh, the rest of japan i mean uh, the proportion of uh, older people in the affected area is much higher in comparison with the case of uh, the japan as a whole so we have to make a reconstruction project under the pressure of aging population in the affected area and in fact many older people in the affected area have uh, uh, worked uh, to sustain the local community and to sustain the local businesses. So I think a great outcome would be if uh, we can make this uh, reconstruction project as uh, a model of a lifelong active society in which the will and uh, uh, the ability of all the people will be fully utilized and uh, which is, uh, you know, uh, necessary for the aging of Japan in the future, as well as the rest of the world sooner or later. Thank you very much.